At first glance, this email from an anonymous viewer is concerning. It says two foreign exchange students from West Africa are headed to one of the Medford schools. Foreign exchange students? No. But today at a press conference, the Medford School District Superintendent Brian Shoemate said it's not true, and they are keeping track of traveling students. There's lots of screening that goes on as people re-enter the country. So if they pass those health tests and we're ensured that people are, um, you know, outside of those travel windows, and aren't showing symptoms, then it's our job to educate kids and make sure that you know we're continuing on as normal. Byrne Case is the director for the Rogue Valley International Medford Airport. He says because there are no direct flights from Africa to Medford, larger airports are in charge of screening travelers for Ebola. Right now if we see somebody that seems unusually sick, uh, we'll contact County Health Department for further evaluation. Some travelers say they're not concerned. Just read and get educated, but there is no need to get panicked over it. I think it's hyped. Yeah, I think they have it under control. I don't think that it's uh, epidemic. I mean, it might be in Africa, but not here. Others say flying is making them nervous right now. We've got to go on 12 airplanes. And uh, I was a little nervous at first. And you see some people with dust masks on and sanitary stuff and I just wash my hands all the time. In Medford, Roma Villavicencio, NBC5 News.